Three uses, one tool. Today I'm reviewing the Master Blaster. It's about $400 on Amazon. It is filtered hot air. You know, there's so many things that this tool could be better at. So many reasons why I thought it was a waste of money at first. But we've owned this now for a year. I wanted to really play around with this. And we use it in our shop every single day. This will help you dry your car. This will work on interiors. It's an oldie and a goodie. It's a Swiss army knife. I never heard about it. It was never reviewed this way. It was never sold this way. But I wanna turn you into MacGyver. I'll tell you all the negatives, because I always do. But I'm also gonna show you why this is so valuable and why we use the Master Blaster every day in our professional auto detailing business. Hey everybody, it's Nick from Hawk Pro Detailing, where my goal is to make you a better detailer. If democracy is the best but messiest form of government out there, I think the Master Blaster, despite all of its flaws, is the best tool that I have bought in at least the last year. Contradictions, flaws, I wanna tell you about why the net is a positive one. We're looking at 120 volts, 18 amps, so yeah, a compressor, you need a lot of tools to get that going as opposed to this, you just plug it in. But at 18 amps, it could trip some breakers. Just want you to know that. There are two switches on here. It is definitely a loud machine. It comes with wheels as well. The kit will come with a way for you to hang this on your wall if you have a tighter space. And the 30 foot hose is great. My biggest complaint about this thing is when I'm working on it, there's no switch to turn it on and off, right? It's so loud and it blows so hard that I have to walk all the way back to the actual tool, the machine, whatever you want to call this thing, and switch it on and off. But I started using this as a ceramic coating drying tool, right? What it does, you're not gonna touch the paint very much. You're gonna reduce scratching. That is absolutely huge for ceramic coating maintenance. People are like, well, why do I get these water spots? Well, the idea is you could blow this off every time it rains. You could blow your hood off, those horizontal surfaces, especially on dark paint, that might get those water spots because the beads are so tight, they just hang out there. And if you wanna see me with some crazy hair, one of our most watched videos is the truth about ceramic coatings. The Master Blaster, it is something that, I just gotta say it works. Like look how dirty this is. We beat the crap out of our tools. Not once have I needed to service or maintenance this. That's huge. And there's a filter on here that does tend to get dirty, so you will need to blow it out with compressed air from time to time to make sure that that air is gonna continue to be filtered. But talking about a ceramic coated car, you wanna blow filtered air. You know, you're not gonna get filtered air through a leaf blower. Because it's so tight, it's not gonna make your car washing absolutely fast, but it will make it um, very efficient. And I gotta say, it's just something that once the hot air gets going, which does take a second, um, it's going to speed up your drying process. I'm gonna get to the interior ninja tricks in a second, but first let's talk about the exterior ways that this thing pays for itself. <laughs> Checking my phone here. About two minutes and 30 seconds in, the Master Blaster started to heat the air. By about four minutes, it wasn't piping hot, but it's about as hot as it gets. So very warm air helps you dry the vehicle so well. And it's going to take you a little extra time with the Master Blaster, but the idea here is you're knocking down all of those little edges where you're gonna get the dripping after you drive your car away and risk water spotting. You can hit those edges hard and then you can do a nice gentle wipe down at the end to make it all work for you. So about four minutes in, I'd say I was probably 10 minutes in master blastering, get some ear protection like some headphones and you're really gonna enjoy the way this helps you not dry it more quickly, but when you look at efficiency, when you look at driving this into the sun or coming back and seeing those water drips, Wiping it down again, at that point, it's gonna be a less safe wiping process, most likely, especially if you're out in the wild, in the grocery store parking lot or somewhere else. So anyway, uh, a quick tutorial of kind of how long it takes for this to get warm and whether you wanna use this or not should depend on the time, but at least you have a sense of how it all works. So we've talked about the exterior use of the Master Blaster. That is how it's advertised. 
And to be honest with you, that's how we use it every day in the shop when we're doing exterior details, how you could use it in your garage as a regular human who doesn't run a detailing business. But the ninja way that we use this is as an interior blowout tool. It is phenomenal. And guess what? Not only does it blow out nooks and crannies with, I feel like, more oomph than an air compressor, what it also does is if you really wanna get crazy with it, let's say you've got air movers, right? You've done some hot water extraction on a vehicle and maybe you only have two air movers, but all the carpets are sopping wet. It's a little creative here, but you can go ninja style. And I know this seems very amateurish, but you can like put this around a headrest. Yeah, you can wedge it into a seat and let's say you steamed in there, maybe it got wet and you don't have any way of drying it. This hot air, you wanna be safe. You wanna make sure your hose is clean. You've got the rubber working for you. You don't want any of the metal to scratch anyone's interior, but it's an amazing way to dry carpets fast. It's not super efficient if you're trying to dry a spot on a seat or a carpet. The way it is efficient, you turn it on, you let it blow hot air, and you go about and finish your job. So I think it's phenomenal for that. And it's also something you can blow around your shop if you're trying to clean up. So lots of uses there. But I want to show you just the power of the blowout. Every interior needs to be fully removed of all dry contaminants that are just going to turn into mud if you try to steam them or use chemicals. So uh, the first thing you do in every detail is remove all the dry stuff. And if you have one guy using the air compressor and you need this, that's how we use it in the shop all the time. Or if you don't have an air compressor, if you don't want to invest in an air compressor, if you don't know which one to buy and what hose to buy and what attachments to buy, you spend about 400 bucks on the Master Blaster and it will do all of this for you. I don't reach for it as the first thing in a car, but sometimes I sort of wish I did. It is a little bit haywire. It will blow things in a lot of different directions, but it definitely does the job. Now we've all seen those rubber dog hair brushes, right? One thing this can double as, because it's rubber, it can sort of dig in to the carpet. Now my Master Blaster is not on because it's too dang loud, but I just want to give you a sense of, it's got a little bit of grip and it will resist a bit of that carpet. And so if you're trying to dislodge things, especially in the initial blowout, it is actually a fantastic tool. It, like I said, it sort of rubs against the fabric and will dislodge some of those little chunks like dog hair or sort of embedded dirt. So as you're blasting, you can use two tools in one. And again, it's another reason why I love this, especially for your initial interior blowouts. Another great way that the Master Blaster doubles as your air compressor is when you're actually cleaning. Now, if you don't have a steamer, this is a great way to detail a door. This is Polestar. We are the first people that I know of to do a video on YouTube about it. We called it the best interior cleaner we've ever found. We have a link to that video above. And truly it is because it foams incredibly well. It's pH neutral. What does that mean? You can let this dwell. You can go number two in the bathroom, call your mom, wish her happy Mother's Day, whatever you need to do. And even if the residue dries, you're not gonna damage the product. So what we love to do is soak down large swaths of our interiors, knowing that the dwell time is going to help our cleaning, knowing that we do not have to worry about overspray, damaging, very expensive leather, vinyl, plastic, you name it. Now, do I wanna let that sit on electronic parts for an extended period of time? No, not exactly. So I'm a little sloppy there, so I'm gonna address that area first. To get in there, if I had steam, it would give me that superpower. But if you don't have a steamer, for example, you can work this, you can make magic, and then I will just come back and I will master blaster this all away. So just doing a final wipe down here. What I love about Koch Kimmy Polestar is it leaves just a nice matte sheen behind. Phenomenal cleaner, but I mean, look at this door panel. That is such an amazing way to clean out your car. 
Again, look at all the things that this Master Blaster can do for you, whether you're a professional detailer or you're sitting at home and you're like, do I want to pay a detailer? Do I maybe want to learn how to detail because it's therapeutic and awesome and it's sort of a superpower if you can clean your car? I think it's an amazing thing. It's very therapeutic, very meditative, and the passion that I exude is because I love what I do. Hey guys, let me know what you think. Yeah, there's leaf blowers out there. Yeah, there's the big boy from Esoteric. There's something about this Master Blaster that is so backwards, so old school, so ridiculous. Like, why isn't there a switch on the handle? Why do I have to walk all the way on this 30-foot hose to turn this thing on and off? Why is it so loud, right? So many things that I don't love about it, and yet I can't live without it. You guys, I'm Nick from Hawk Pro Detailing. My goal is to make you a better detailer. If you wanna learn more about how to dial in carpets, I've got a link above. And what it's all about is the best carpet cleaning products I have ever found. Forget degreasers, forget Polestar. This is straight from the carpet cleaning industry. Watch that video, have your life changed. And thank you again for what you do, which is supporting us. Small business, someone who loves what I do. And I just love sharing what I've learned.